I did not know that. Welcome, and I've decided to start a new category on this channel called I Did Not Know That Classic TV. I hope you enjoy it. Ever wonder about something? Maybe you'll find it here. Check out all the other videos on this channel, and remember to like and subscribe. In this, this corner, corner, at 5'8 and 165, 165 pounds, pounds, wearing the red, red shirt, shirt and, and sailor's, sailor's cap, Bob Gilligan, Gilligan Denver. Denver. In the, the other, other corner, corner, at 6 feet, feet and 190 pounds, pounds and wearing a beanie cap, we, we have George Goober Lindsay. Lindsay. Almost everyone is familiar with the two characters of Goober and Gilligan. Goober was played by George Lindsay on The Andy Griffith Show, and Bob Denver played Gilligan on Gilligan's Island. The two programs aired on CBS in the 1960s. Back in 1973, Lindsay and Denver happened to be making an appearance on the same episode of Love American Style. If you're not familiar with the show, it usually consisted of two or three different skits where a couple falls in love or they deal with a conflict that is threatening their relationship. Think of it as the love boat without the boat. Many of the actors who appeared on the show were often familiar faces. Some were up and coming actors, others were stars from past TV series, or some were faded film stars. The episode Lindsay and Denver appeared in together was called Love and the Eats Cafe. Lindsay tells in his autobiography that while filming that episode together, he and Bob Denver hit it off and Denver invited George and his family over for dinner. The trouble was that during the dinner both actors began to drink and Lindsay admits in his book that he had a problem with alcohol in those days. He said that back then the more he'd drink the more obnoxious he'd become and then it wasn't long before he'd start looking for a reason to fight. The two began to argue about, of all things, who was the better actor. We know that Bob Denver will only put up with so much from those Mayberry folks because before he was Gilligan, he tried to pick a fight with Andy Taylor after he thought Andy stole his wife, Charlene Darling. Kidding aside, it wasn't long before Denver and Lindsay came to actual blows. Lindsay said they fought all over Denver's house, and he said that in the middle of the fight, he'd do an imitation of the skipper inside. Oh, Gilligan! Which I'm sure really even irritated Bob Denver more. One can imagine how horrified both their families were watching this spectacle. Lindsay said there was no clear winner in the battle, and claimed that he thought he and Bob Denver parted friends after the fight. But he added that he never saw Denver or spoke with him again after that night. George, that might have been a clue that all was not well between you two. One positive note about this strange story is that in his book, Lindsay said he eventually realized that he had a drinking problem and he stopped drinking in 1980 and he never touched the stuff again. Well, that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it, and thanks so much for stopping by and watching my channel.